Alright, this is a brief tutorial for people who need to create Google accounts uh, but don't want an actual Gmail account. Um, this is uh, for uh, high school students, HBCS students, who need to be able to go in and um, work on Google Docs, make comments, um, uh, change things around, but don't necessarily want to have a whole new email account. Um, all right, so here's what you do. You get yourself onto a regular old Google page. Um, and somewhere over here, you're going to see a button that says Sign In. Uh, yours might look slightly different, but just look for the Sign In button. Click on that. I have a couple of different accounts, um, but yours probably will have blank unless you're at school, and you'll see a bunch of other accounts from different students there. Um, but either way, you're going to go to Add an Account. If you don't see Add an Account, it's because it's buried way down there underneath a bunch of different um, uh, accounts that are listed right here. So just scroll down and you'll see add an account. Click it and then you'll see something a little bit like this but you don't want that. You again want the create an account button because you're making something brand new. Um, if you don't see this, once again scroll down. It's going to be down towards the bottom here. Click on create and here's where you're going to put in all your inf information. Um, right here where it says choose your username you can just click this one right here I prefer to use my own email and that's where you would put in whatever email you currently have Yahoo Hotmail whatever you like um, and again it can be a parent's email um, but again first and last um, you make a password please make it something that you can remember um, if it's a struggle for you I recommend um, maybe your school ID, double it because I think they need more um, numbers than that or even just your home phone number. Uh, it's not like you're storing crazy personal information here. Um, and then you have to put in this little robot thing down here. Um, and then you're going to sign in and you will then have an account. You can log in after that with whatever email you put in here and whatever password you put here and that way you will be able to um, go into for example the newsletter uh, folder and do your work. Alright, give me a call if you have any questions and good luck.